Residents say seeing firefighters arrive was a welcome sight. After a sickening and thickening mix of soot and smoke invaded many of the 15 apartments in this building at 1802 Lurting Avenue. My sister just wakes me up and everything is just smoky black in my room. It was a dark smoke. Firefighters discovered elevated levels of carbon monoxide and instructed many but not all of the residents to leave the building. At least eight of the residents reported feeling sick. Four of them were taken to hospitals and all are expected to be okay. A little boy, a teenager, and two grown people pulled down the ambulance. Are you working on the boiler now? Yeah. They the did. building superintendent would not talk to us about the incident, referring us to the building's owner, who we left messages for but have not heard back. The super ushered us to the boiler room. See all the black stuff on the floor, right? The soot. Where these technicians questioned the Department of Buildings' claims that its records show this boiler in decent shape just four months ago. Now, it passed its last inspection in November. It ain't passed it. I don't know what kind of inspection he was to pass, but it ain't passed this. It had to stay on top of it. You got to clean it every other year or every year. And this one you don't think was? It wasn't, no. Nah. A fire official who spoke to us off camera told us too much neglect exists in this and other buildings. The message for tenants is to make sure carbon monoxide detectors work. And for building owners, make sure a boiler is never allowed to get so caked with soot and filth that it blows. This one now shut down by the Department of Buildings until further notice. In the Morris Park section of the Bronx, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.